Hi everybody, Kai Jack here, and here I'm going to show you today how to keep your stinger hook on another hook without it falling off after you cast it. Uh, that seems to be a common problem. Now, I know a lot of guys use stoppers of different sorts, but I'm going to show you something today that's very simple, and all you need is a plastic jug, maybe even a smaller one than this if you want. But I'm going to show you how you can use this plastic jug to keep this hook on your lure. So let's take a closer look here. So you can get a package of these stinger hooks like this. Here's a one-aught here. Uh, you can buy them with the uh, plastic already on them. And these stand pretty good sometimes, but they do get wore out a little bit. But one thing that I found is that a simple plastic jug... You take your hole punch, and I've already cut this jug up, and you can see the holes punched in it. And all you do is put it on there, and then get some plastic, and start punching away, and then save a few. After that, you can take them out of the hole punch, and then I usually keep them in a little plastic bag like this here, and they're very tiny, of course, and clear, and very, very stealthy, as you can see. All right. And then what I do is I'll take my hook, put it on my lure here. And then you take your hook, you punch through the plastic, and then... Put it on, and there you go. You have it on there, and it's not going to come off there. And it's just a little plastic insert. Now, one one lure that they work really well on are when you put them on a fluke. You put a treble hook on a fluke, and you can see here I had this set up. And if that treble hook comes out of the fluke, that hook is going to stay on there right, rather than flying off. So, I mean, I think there's a lot of guys doing this now as well. So you can keep it on there and uh, it, it will stay. Um, and here's one with, uh, you can buy, you can get rubber tubing as well. I just think it's kind of big and bulky on there. And uh, so I go with the, the old milk jug, milk jug uh, caps here. And, and uh, so there's a little tip for you on keeping. So if you like what you saw here today um, with this tip, this little hack with the milk jug, I've got a lot more tips coming up. So just, you know, if you want to just like and subscribe to this channel, that'd be great. If not, that's okay. But I'll be coming out with more tips here soon um, with uh, fishing and more specifically kayak fishing. I'll give you some ideas that might help you out on the water. Thanks.